Hi guys, Jordan here. I'm having a bad day, so I thought I would do a video on what hopefully is a tasty snack. Uh, but I've been wrong before, and I'll probably be wrong again, so stay tuned. Uh, I'll be reviewing Fiber One 90 calorie bars. I don't know what they're called, just Fiber One bars, probably. Um, interesting history lesson. Uh, Fiber One is owned by General Mills. There's a little tiny logo about them there. Uh, General Mills can kind of trace its history back to 1875. It's like one of the big old American breakfast wheat thingo companies. Uh, very interesting. Um, I don't know how big they are in Australia, but they're like a Fortune 500 company in America. Uh, we don't have that in Australia, but I also think they're like 182nd in the Fortune 500, so like they're huge. Uh, but again, Australia, uh, big American companies like that generally struggle to break into the Australian market for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, but anyways, um, recent controversies, I think they changed their legal terms so that if you like engage with their coupons or like even posts on their social media forums that kind of thing you accept their new legal terms which is uh, you consent to um, not joining class action lawsuits and kind of excluding yourself to arbitrations and small claims courts very interesting stuff they've re since removed it but very interesting um, very sneaky uh, again no longer a thing so just a bit of background on what's probably just a little breakfast bar uh, which hopefully tastes good i've got my tea here uh, love tea yeah it's still a bit too hot sorry about that so fiber one 90 calorie obviously i'm assuming it's 90 calories uh doesn't actually say how many calories uh, 85 calories of energy per serving so there's five of them in here. They cost $5.50. It's really not that substantial. Uh, it's like 100 grams, 105 grams of stuff. They're 21 grams a bar. Uh, I chose this flavor because it looks sick. Milk chocolate popcorn bars. Heck yeah. So yep, yeah, there's five of them. They are tiny. They are very small. That's what they look like. Uh, the picture on the thing is blurry. I don't know if you can see that, so that's funny. Um, but also doesn't really mean anything, but they definitely could improve there. Uh, 21 grams, what do we have? One gram of protein, 3.6 grams of fat, uh, 9.7 grams of carbs, 4.7 grams of those carbs of sugar. So I reckon this might be a bit sweet, even though it's 90 calories. Let's have a crack. It's got a picture of a pretzel and a popcorn on it. So I'm assuming that's in there. Some interesting um, I don't know what that's called, maybe oxidization of the chalky there. Uh, looks like some oil has come out and then solidified, interesting. Uh, that looks like an LCM bar on the top with little chunks in it. This looks like it could taste really good, so I'm gonna taste it. Okay, so, good bits, kind of crunchy. There's definitely popcorn in there, but it's like stale popcorn. So, probably not the best. They do have other flavors that don't have popcorn in it. The, the popcorn's stale, so it's like, that's not great. Uh, the chalky is nice, at least. The pretzel's really good. The LCMs are really good. The popcorn in this really lets it down. That being said, I still eat all five of these.
got more of that oxidization of the chalky, which isn't unappealing to look at. It's also got some like oats in here, and probably helps with the fiber. Is there not that much fiber in chalky and pretzel? There's a lot of fiber in oats though. Tasty. Maybe get rid of the popcorn though. Thanks for listening.